Well, this didn't really amount to anything. Yeah. <coughs> Sorry about that. Can I go over here? No. Ah. 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 Got really jammed inside something. It's, 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 it's fine. It's fine. I mean, I technically haven't explored whatever's beyond here, but it kind of feels like I can't go that way because that'd be like the ending or something, right? That's like my whole goal was to go there. I could try. Oh. Okay. They let me in. No way. It's you. Hey, how'd you get free? I was born free, Boatnik. Nobody gave me no ticket, so nobody can take it away. So what are you pacing around here for? Trying to unwind a little bit. All those years circling in one direction. Gotta even out my life in this world before I go on to the next, you know? Well, that ought to do her. Goodbye, Chapito. Happy trails, Captain. And thanks for setting me straight back there in the drink. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Hide it under some seaweed. No, I'm gonna let it shine. Oh boy. Well, goodbye. His animation looked like it was glitching out because he got stuck on the wall, but I think the point was he's supposed to be running around... I guess this way, right? He'd be walking in the opposite direction of how he walked while he was on the ocean floor, because he apparently decided he'd even out how many circles he did. That's some OCD right there. See, I came in through that door. There's been a lot of animation glitches in this game, I'm not really sure why. Maybe they're from the original and would happen sometimes, I or- I actually do it. I could walk out of this world right now and not look back, but I can't. I can't do it. I'm not leaving without the people I promised to save. Yep, gotta commit. But the, it, it could also just be weird issues with the remaster. Like, just weird haphazard messes. Double Fine has not really been known for their quality control or extended development lately. A lot of early access games and abandoned development projects and stuff like that, so they might have kind of botched it a little bit. It hasn't affected the gameplay though. It's just been some animations that don't work, basically. I around in it like Chibito, but I think a better way to even out my life would be to go get those tickets. We really don't have anything to go with here. This place seems rather empty. Like it's just a chance to spot Chibito and take a look at the exit, but I'm not allowed to actually leave yet. What happened to that train? Your destiny cannot be purchased. I don't understand. Why has everyone been detained? Given a ticket, a soul may not sell it. They didn't sell their tickets. Someone else is trying to. Bring the tickets. That is all. The tickets are in Elmaro. How can I get there quickly? These rails are already there. My friend is sick, can you help us? A thousand demons have died upon delivering the souls they were created to protect. Well, thanks for the help. The gate opens, the gate closes. It does not help. He seems nice. Okay, so I think I get what's going on here. I need to fix Glottis, make him better, and then we can, like, Go back? He said the rails are already there, so we could probably ride the rails back to the previous areas, find the tickets, and use those. If we find the tickets, we can use those to get uh, everyone to be safe, and then we can all go, right? Curious about this kitchen. Sadly, I have no mug to hang. Always a good idea to have a clean rag around. There is a rag. I'm not in the mood to dust. Hmm. Oh. You did what? Hmm. Happiness is a warm rag. We just toasted the rag to make it warmer? What if I make it explodey? There's, there's, yeah, there's oil around here. This better not stain my pocket. I'm not gonna put it in my pocket. I'm gonna put it here. Okay, I mean, you did that to yourself. That's your fault. 
Oh boy. Happiness is a ha ah! Happiness. Oh. What was in that mug? Something that powerful could fuel a, a rocket. rocket. If only we had more. Well, I could score you a couple of truckloads if you're interested. We shoot you now like an arrow into the wind. May you pierce the heart of the wind itself and drink the blood of flight. Speed is the food of the great Glottis. Speed bring you life. Come back to us someday. Of course. Thanks, Glottis. <laughs> Jesus. All the way back to where we were two years ago. Ah, Rubicava! What a town! Remember the glory days, Manny? Long gone, my friend. There's nothing here for us now. Except maybe our old car. Ooh. Dios mio! She's been booby-trapped. By who? Who? What? Why? <laughs> why? I mean, I, I mean, I guess I know why. It's the guy that wants to kill us, but this is bizarre. So they got our car and they put up an incredibly... Oh. Oh. Domino. He set up a domino- domino set up a domino trap on our car. It's gonna blow- and the last domino will hit that, uh... Will hit that plunger and blow everything up. Gonna wanna save real quick, I think. Ah, uh, just use the same one. This- uh, we haven't been in this chapter long. I'm not setting foot down there. The slightest bump could start those dominoes tumbling. What do I have on me right now? A paper and a scythe. Great. Poor guy. So nervous. I think he's gonna be sick. Don't panic. <laughs> when has he ever not panicked? I'm not setting foot down there. The slightest bump could start those dominoes tumbling. I'm not setting foot down there. The slightest bump could start those dominoes tumbling. Don't panic. <laughs> what a trooper. Looks like Domino left his calling card. But how? I saw him torn to shreds. He must have done this on his last trip through town. Okay, so we're back in the biggest quest hub of the entire goddamn game, and I have a vague goal of get past that thing, which is not really useful. Maintenance has gotten pretty lax around here, apparently. Okay, that's why that exists in this game. It didn't affect the progression through the game the first time around, but this time around, it blocks me from going that way. Which means that they can guide me a little bit more of where to go this chapter. It's locked, but there's nothing up there anyway. That goes to the upper dock, but nothing's docked there now. Again? You'd figure the, the boat from last time would be back by now. Is my friend over here? Wait, you are. Manuel Calavera? Ha ha ha! Well, what happened to the limbo? Hate to tell you, Velasco, but she went down at the Pearl. But we found a new ship, the SS La Mancha, and managed to... The La Mancha? My old rusty bucket? Where is she? Oh, well, we traded her in Puerto Zapato for a team of sled dogs. That does it. I'm out of this stinking mob town. But thanks for finding my baby, Manny. Puerto Zapato, here I come. Mob town? Oh, sounds like bad things have happened here. Ooh, what's this thing? Maybe I'll just finish this for him. 
Hey, it's the thing that he was using at the beginning of the game. Oh yeah, that is a ship in the bottle, and it's got a hilarious super low resolution thing inside of it. It looks like someone's Minecraft drawing, basically. Like when you do pixel art in Minecraft, but at a larger scale. The Lamanca. Isn't the Lamanca the same? I don't remember. I don't remember. It might be the same boat that was that was left right when we got into town the first time, and we went to the gate. Like that's where the Lamanca is supposed to be, but it's gone. But either way, it's his old boat. I don't know if it's if it's that one or not. The blue casket. Who's around here? Great. No one. I just will. I do. Olivia. Calavera, what are you doing here? I heard you went pow in Zapato, Daddy. Well, Hector Lamont's tried and missed. Now it's my turn. I'm headed to El Maro to put him out of business. Manny, that place has changed. You don't know what you're getting into. I'd better come with you. Just give me a minute to get ready. Okay, but if you hear a loud explosion anytime soon, the trip's off. I just can't do it without an audience. I clicked on a- uh, I didn't realize I was skipping dialogue at first. Whoops. I? I would, but I hate sucking gelatin straight from the tap. Not here. Are we gonna- Are we what? That's what the lumbago diorama needed. Fake ocean water. Excuse me? Can you even see the boat inside anymore? That's what the lumbago diorama needed. Fake Whoa. ocean water. Why have I done this? Okay, I mean, I guess I don't have to open it with the scythe anymore. I'm not gonna eat off of. Is it time to go yet? No, we're having a little car trouble. Come by when it's time. Come by when it's time. Is the bottle used in the solution? Can I go up here? It's locked. Okay, so that entire half of the map is closed off. The ele the setup of having an elevator... The setup of having an elevator and that one weird walkway make more sense now, because it cuts this map in half. So you, when you come here this late in the game, you don't have as much map to f be confused by. He called it a mob town. Has crime taken over? It's noteworthy that everyone seems to be gone, and no work seems to have really occurred since I left. Oh, Lola. Is that all that happens around here? I guess that's that. So many people have died in this game. And I don't mean the part where they're all skeletons. Because <laughs> all of them died. Except the demons, I guess? Unless demons are reincarnated people. What if you become a demon because you die in this life? Like you die in this, in this lifetime, then come back as a demon? Poor guy. So nervous. I think he's gonna be sick. Oh wait, I can still try the tattoo parlor. That's the last part of town that's still connected to here. And if I don't figure it out from going here, then I'm just gonna have to start mashing things on other things like I usually do. Because some of these items mix together to do something. Hey, tattoo guy, are you also a domino specialist? I don't want to wake up Toto. Doesn't hurt. Liquid nitrogen, not to be used on bone. Liquid nitrogen? Doesn't hurt. Maybe I can use that to freeze the bomb? Hello, operator? Yeah, it's me, Manny. I was just passing through town and... Doesn't hurt. Wow. 
Still man. Damn, it's been two years. Oh, Toto's plum tuckered out. Not my no, fault! I don't want to disturb his grumpy little dreams. Oh, Toto's plum tuckered out. He's having dreams about giving people uh, tattoos. Quit whining, it doesn't hurt. Not a ton of don't wake up Toto going on here, but maybe I can use the liquid nitrogen? If that doesn't work, I'll be a little confused about what to do. Don't panic. Oh, calm down. You can't use it here? I'm not setting foot down there. The slightest bump could start those dominoes tumbling. How about you? You drink alcohol, right? Is it alcohol? Oh, it's the jelly. I drink it, but I'd probably get the SS Lumbago stuck in my throat. Hello? Oh, is he trying to rotate towards me? He is. Why is he he's having so much trouble? <laughs> What's, What's happening? That? It's a uh, lumbago lemonade. Try it. Mm. Perkly little aperitif, actually. <laughs> yes, sirree. Not bad, tall. <laughs> Tell me where you got that right now. Olivia's kitchen. Lumbago lemonade! Manny, aren't we in a hurry? Don't worry, this won't take long. Oh, my stomach don't stretch like it used to. Oh, Gladys. What did we just do? Why did, why did we do that? So what is that stuff they pack canned hams in anyway? Good show, my friend. You wouldn't happen to have a breath mint on you, I suppose. Um... Did you just knock over every domino? How? I'm sorry, the how? Is still liquefied. It wouldn't stop the dominoes from falling. Uh, how did the, uh, No, how? How did you spread out the dominoes across the liquid- What? How did the vomit not knock over the domino- Whatever. Adventure games, they're nonsense. It's pretty clear what to do here. Freeze it. Ta-da! I know hey, that Photoshop good effect. Idea. I bet I could keep it down now that it's cold. Just let me get across first, okay? Did that just make the sound of... I think that just made the sound of a shower. Mmm, looks good. But I prefer it with pineapple rings. I'd better disarm her first. I'd better disarm her first. I'd rather defuse the bomb first. Oh, right. I can probably cut off the... The fuse. Right? I don't want to mess up my blade. 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 I don't want to mess up. Really? Not doing me a lot of help here. I'd better disarm her first. I'd better disarm her first. You have any ideas? Piece of cake. Looks better. Feels better. Okay. I'd rather defuse the bomb first. 
I'd better disarm her first. Well, here goes nothing. Oh. I guess I did it. Wow, like we're going way back. The whole town. He hasn't had much resistance. There's only one small group who oppose him, and they live out on the fringes of the city. Places like this, you mean? I hope they're not hurting Gladys. Ha. Huh. Shows what you know about this group. Their leader is a great man who... Manuel Calavera, we meet again. I see you have found what you were looking for. How fortunate for you to arrive now just as we too are about to achieve success. Our army has grown, and right now our top agents are in Hector's weapons lab, about to close in on the enemy in his own den. I couldn't have done it without you, Manuel. <laughs> It was a trap. Stand back. There's only one thing to do. <gasps> Thank you, sir. You have saved me. But more than that, you have enabled me to continue to serve the movement. What did you say about a trap? Hector uncovered our agent in his weapons lab. No. Your new lab assistant is a spy! Haven't you ever heard of a background check? What? No time to explain. Now I'll have to take matters into my own hands. Take me with you. I've longed to be of service to your cause for years. Well now, learn a few things. Walking dead rules apply here apparently, where you take somebody, if you chop off the infection it doesn't spread. It is straight up just a flower thing that goes through your body, like that is what it is. Huh. Also I was just straight up wrong, I th <laughs> earlier I thought that the bad guy got taken out on that train, and I was like that's kind of a weird, like unceremonious way to take out the bad guy in this game. But I also kind of thought the game was about to end, like we were about to go through the gate after we fixed Glottis and probably leave him behind, but but healthy. Because we're there, but he got this complication, so now we're going back to take out the bad guy, who looks wildly different from what I thought he did. Uh, but I think we I think we only saw him in like one cutscene at the beginning of the game, so I don't really have him recorded in my brain. I bet the agent in this photo is the poor guy that Hector just shot. Let's look at that then. I bet the agent in this photo is the poor guy that Hector just shot. Nothing else in there besides that agent's photo. Come here, little manny. Ow! Hey, must be little Meche. Must be little Meche. Must be little Meche. <laughs> this camera's showing nothing but flowers. Must be another fallen agent. Hector, I almost have that new bouquet of tulips ready for you. Listen to me once and for all, Palsley. You are not a florist! You are a manufacturer of weapons! But I... Isn't he kind of a florist then? Seems like he's a florist. You should probably want him to be good at floristing if you want him to be making your flower weapons. Better save this part from sprouting. Ah! There's more limb? Ah, that's creepy. The rest of him has gone to seed already. Memo to all agents, priority urgent. In light of the recent disappearances, all agents are ordered to avoid travel in unlit areas until further notice. Why can't they just take the sprouts off though? Or burn it or something. Any messages for me? Nope, call stopped coming for you the day you left. They're still sending you that lingerie catalog though. Well, how many of those do I have? It's my ex-boss's ex-secretary, Ava. You're never gonna let me forget the secretary thing, are you? 
Any messages for me? No, call thirst. It's my ex boss's ex. You know? I totally screwed up and thought that she was Lola. It's hard to keep these characters straight when they look so they look and sound relatively similar sometimes. I thought she was the resistance character that was in chapter two and died. Calling all cars, calling all cars. Manuel, is everything okay? Uh, the, just testing the equipment, Sal. Salvador, maybe you should shut that thing off so we can talk. I don't think they're just talking right now. Salvador, come in. Salvador? They're not just talking at all, are they? I take Mecha to all the best places. Okay, here's the plan. I need a disguise so I can get close to Hector, and a gun so we'll have something to talk about when I get there. If you figure out that part, I'll go find out where he is. His casino tower is directly above these headquarters. All right, meet me there. Volunteers quickly for dangerous work. She could be very useful to the cause. As far as I'm concerned, she is the cause. Any messages? No. No, no, no dialogue after that exchange. The casino tower is above us. Is our headquarters still in the same place? Because if that's the case, he converted the building. Hello down there. Hello down there. You know, if I had had a car like this when I was alive, things would have been different. Not right now. Not right now. You don't want to talk to Gladys? Best, best friend Gladys? How you feeling, Gladys? Not right. Or we're feeling pretty not right now. <laughs> oh my God! This area just keeps going. Can I even reach that letter? Yes. Answers yes. What's back here, though? Oh, what's this thing that's in front of me? Oh, that's weird. I think there's just a lot of minor stray details everywhere. That, like little. Textures that don't quite cut out correctly and really weird things like that. I don't know what's involved in the restoration process. Okay, I don't know what's down there, but I have issues with it. Oh boy. Okay. How about this one? Anyone down here? Monsters? Again? How many monsters are there? How about this one? Anyone down here? Monsters? Again? Can anyone hear me besides the scary monster? Dang. Go to sleep, sewer thing. Close your big clay blind eyes. Go to sleep, sewer thing. Close your big clay blind eyes. I get the feeling that's not working. <laughs> down there but I have issues with it we're down to having our scythe this note nitrogen photo arm hmm Kind of, especially given this context of this situation, I'm kind of find it weird that he was trying to hide the note of the threat on his life. Seems plenty relevant. There's the casino. Got to figure out some way to disguise this pretty face before I hit the street. How about here? I guess m maybe the same thing. No, we're allowed to go here. What are the, what are those? Are those people? I think they're people. It's not like Johnny Thunder lets just anybody in his review. No. I mean, being allowed to wear the Johnny Thunder makeup is an honor. Yes. A privilege. Yes. So I said to her, you give me that 10% discount or I'm taking my business elsewhere. You said that? Well, oh yes, I was mad, you know. And then, here's the good part. Really? Okay. Seems straightforward. I'm clearly going to have the Johnny... The Johnny Thunder disguise. Mmm, show business coffee. Oh, yeah. Oh. 
That's not how you hold a coffee cup or how you pour coffee. Wow. Time we got a PA around here. Hey kid, keep it black and keep it coming, all right? So what did you Nothing about that animation will quite work. Place to serve coffee here. It tried though. Too hot for my pockets. Thank you. A little too hot for my pockets. Thank you. Yeah, I'm trying to put it back. There we go. Fighting me on it. Is there something I can spike the coffee with? The nitrogen, I guess. Except it would just freeze, and then it wouldn't be coffee. Pardon me, Thunder Boys, but oh, are you here for the Thunder Boy tryouts? Yes, I am. Oh, that's too bad. Because we just got the last two parts. Maybe next season. <laughs> hey, get lost, pal. No autographs. Well, they're not very nice, are they? Can I release this thing and make something falls on them? Of course, as soon as I save up enough money for a double N ticket, I'm out of here. What? You can't just buy a double N. Well, I know somebody who knows somebody who knows uh, Hector Lamas. Wow, you know everybody. You don't say. You're going to die. So out of the dressing room. We got all the Thunder Boys we need. Oh, an entire room of Thunder Boys. So none of these people know that they're all getting sold tickets that just send them to hell. So not only is he dooming everybody who the tickets were made for in the first place, everyone the tickets were made for in the first place are being held in a purgatory of sorts because they can't escape. They can't go because they they're claimed they're blamed for selling their tickets basically. Everyone he tries to sell them to goes to hell because the tickets don't actually work. They kind of work, they get you on the train, but that's it. And then... There's also counterfeit ones for some reason. I gotta ask if they've seen this guy. That's no way to treat an agent of the LSA. Hey, get lost, pal. No autographs. Hey, get lost, pal. No autographs. Are you guys gonna be really annoying? Hey, look at arm, guys. Wiggity wiggity. That would be disrespectful. No autographs. Wiggity 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 wiggity. Can I just murder them? Hey guys. Hey, get lost, pal. No autographs. Hey, look at that one guy's a murderer. Hey, get lost, pal. No autographs. Not interested in that? All right. I mean, I could try doing this. There can't be too much in here. I'd better save it. There can't be too much in here. I'd better save it. Not quite going anywhere yet, is it? <laughs>